and true still to this bum 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 one two and 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 three four one two three and four and one and two and three four one two three and four and one and two and three four so again all those syncopations one two three and four and one and two and three four and that's what I say, it's that palindrome rhythm. So that's what's going on if you're wondering. A major, F major, A major. Hey folks, welcome to today's lesson. It's Triste. Antonio Carlos Jobim, let's get started. Play by the strings, but when you have the root and fifth of the chord, it doesn't tell you whether it's major or minor because it doesn't have the third degree. So that's what's going on there with the drone and then the guitar. in there. So this this is a really beautiful example of these open string chord voicings that I always love to share because they're not typical. You don't see them in books too often. But I think by now many of you who have taken my Bossa Nova workshops are used to these chord voicings. This is A major 9. And you can finger it like this. It's open A G sharp C sharp, so it's a major seven, and then you got the B string, that's a nine, and then the E, which is your fifth. So it actually has all five notes of an A major nine chord, one, three, five, seven, nine. Obviously not in that order, but listen to it. Okay, and I'm actually strumming all five. pattern. I'll talk about that in a second after we get the chord voicings. But again, this is A major 9. And the tab would be 0 on the A string. Don't play the E string. A, so it's 0, 6, 6, open, open. And just get used to that color. And then you can also May do this, take the G sharp and go to F sharp. You can do stuff like that, which you're gonna hear that when they're comping underneath the melody. And it creates that nice voice leading. It's pretty subtle. It's tricky to play though, because you have to be really careful. You want those open strings to ring constantly. And again, so I know many of you who've learned Black Orpheus with me, Gentle Rain, or any of these A minor key bossa nova. I always do this shape. I think I used that also in the B section to, or one note samba, many of you learned that in there too. Same idea, you can go to the six here. So A minor, nine, zero, five, five, zero, zero, to A minor, six, nine. Okay, it's those open strings that really are very special here. syncopated. After the one, two, everything is on the offbeat. So here it is slowly. One, two, three, and, 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 and three, four. And again, similar to the other patterns that we did, it's kind of like a palindrome rhythm. One, two, and then you have all those syncopations. Three, four, you know, those quarter note, two quarter notes at the very beginning and then the two chord notes at the very end of the second measure. It's a two bar pattern. One, two, three, and four, and one, and two, and three, four. One, two, three, and, 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 and three, four. I'm really grouping these fingers together tight so that they're, they can all pluck simultaneously. 
and I am using my pinky here. And I'm so I'm hitting all five strings. But you may choose just to do four strings. Okay, it doesn't quite matter too much. That E, I like it. I like that drone in the E. It's there in the strings, but. And then simply move your fingers down one fret and then you have that A minor nine. Okay, same rhythm. We want to keep that same bossa rhythm. One, two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, and four, and one, and two, and three, four, switch. And, 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 and three, four. One, two, three, and four, and one, and two, and three, four. One, two, three, and four, and one, and two, and three, again. He starts on the major key and then goes to the parallel minor key as a cool intro. It's kind of like, am I happy or am I sad? I'm not sure. You know, it's just what I would just recommend. These are kind of special. As you all know, playing bossa nova, you get some really cool chord shapes that are not always typical. There, there's an F major seven when you're in A minor. This. They go together. F major seven, A minor seven. They're kind of a, it's often a sub. It's a three. So the F major seven, what I'm saying is borrowed from the A minor key, A minor world. Okay, it's in the A minor parallel world. So that's what's going on if you're wondering. A major, F major, A major. And I want you to just play a little bar chord, B minor seven. G sharp minor seven flat five, C sharp seven. And that's a two five leading us to F sharp minor. F sharp minor is the relative minor of A major. It's a six, but it's a really nice movement leading us to five into the F sharp minor seven. You can do it like this. I'm sometimes I'll just bar across. Again, this, these are what I refer to as just grip shapes. Hopefully you have I do feel shapes. like it's important to think about what's happening with the progression. You know, uh, again, now from that F sharp minor seven, we go up a whole step to the dominant, and now we that pulls us to the new key, C sharp major. We have a two five, but then it turns to minor. And once we're on that C sharp minor, we're set. Sharp nine, A major nine. Now we're at the B section. Da, 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 da. Da, da, da. So check out the B section there. That's different from the beginning of the song. It's similar but different because now it goes A major seven, this. E seven sharp five. That's an augmented. Have that open string if you want to. That's no different from just doing an augmented like this. Just with the open string. But check it out from the B minor nine. And I continue to the last two bars before it goes back to the top to where it resolves on A minor, not A major. So it, would you say the song's in the key of A major or A minor? I would say A major, even though the final chord <laughs> is A minor 7. D major 9, G13, C sharp minor 7. That's a quick 3-6 there, you know, the 2-5 movement. So that's C sharp minor 7, F sharp 7, sharp 5, B dominant 9. Oh, sorry, B dominant nine, I'll say it correctly and play it correctly. And then minor it. E7 sharp five. And then this A minor. 